A federal judge in Florida dismissed the classified documents case against former President Donald Trump on Monday, siding with defense lawyers who said the special counsel who filed the charges was illegally appointed by the Justice Department. The decision by U.S. District Judge Aileen Cannon, which is expected to be appealed and may eventually be overturned by a higher court, brings, at least for now, a stunning and abrupt conclusion to a criminal case that, at the time it was filed, was widely regarded as the most perilous of all the legal threats the Republican former president confronted. Though the case had long been stalled, and the prospect of a trial before the November election already non-existent, the judge's order is a significant legal and political victory for Trump as he recovers from a weekend assassination attempt and prepares to accept the Republican nomination in Milwaukee this week. It's the latest stroke of good fortune in the four criminal cases Trump has faced. He was convicted in May in his New York hush money trial, but the sentencing has been postponed after a Supreme Court opinion that conferred broad immunity on former presidents. That opinion will cause major delays in a separate case charging Trump with plotting to overturn his 2020 election loss to Democrat Joe Biden. Another election subversion case filed in Atlanta has been delayed by revelations of a romantic relationship between the district attorney and a special prosecutor she hired for the case. In a statement on his social media platform, Trump said that the dismissal should be just the first step and that the three other cases, which he called witch hunts, should also be thrown out. 